Trippin' flippin' at it with the habits Paid a couple thousand for the cash Niggas wanna sleep well after being savage Vertical face flips, get the fucking case it Bags in my eyes and my dreams in the hill piss Burning all the pictures of the dreams in the mansion Using dirty dishes, Mr. Liam Charles Manson Smooth nigga, full step you rise up Boom nigga, cross head in sight The true nigga, concrete both sides Who you nigga, what? How is it going today, Lord? Let's get away from it. What do I Jack say we have for you? Join the Lucas, I am not a racist. Um, you guys highly requested this, this one. This is trending on Twitter. So. Yeah, so you know it like, must I be good. I don't want nobody to ruin it for me. <laughs> not ruin it. <laughs> um, if you guys have any reaction requests, please follow us on all our social medias in the link in the description below. And don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe, pillow. I'm with you. I don't have pity for you, black niggas. That's the way I feel. Mm. Mm. Screaming uh, black lives damn. matter. All the black guys rather be dead beats to pay your bills. Mm. Yelling nigga this and nigga that. Call everybody nigga and get a nigga mad. No as soon as I say nigga, people, then everyone bro. react and want to swing at me and call me racist because I ain't black. Compound that then. Talking about slavery like you was around back then. Like you was picking yeah. cotton off the fucking ground back then. Mm. Like you was mm. on the plantation getting down back then. Right. I see a black man aiming his gun, but I'd rather see a black man claiming his son. Now I mean just oh, one day you done. I mean, you still trapped in a rut. I work my ass off and pay my taxes for what? So you can keep living on free government assistance, food stands for your children, but you still trying to sell them for some weed and some liquor or a fucking babysitter while you party on Dang. the road because you ain't got no fucking goals. You want me to get your damn priority you know. straight. Wait, it's like you're proud to be fake, but you lazy as fuck. You'd rather sell drugs and get a job and be straight, and then you turn around and complain about the poverty break. Fuck out of my face. You can't escape problems. You can pray for some change, but can't break a dollar. Mm, Got nobody else it. to blame, so you blame Donald. You fuck the world with a make America great condo. My boy's been back. I'm not racist. My sister's boyfriend's black. I'm not racist. My sister-in-law's baby cousin Tracy. Got a brother and his girlfriend's black. <laughs> sure. My head's in the cloud. Heard it's not enough jobs for all the men in your house. Maybe we should build a wall to keep the Mexicans out. Or maybe we should okay, send them all to the ghetto for now. I'm not racist. <coughs> And I never lied, but I think it's a disconnect between your culture and mine. I worship the Einsteins, study the Steve Jobs, but you ride Tupac's dick like he was a fucking god. Oh my god! Ooh. And all you care about is rapping and stunting and being ratchet, and that's the nigga within you. Music right in your brain and slowly start to convince you that you let your kids listen, and then the cycle continues. Blame it all on the menu, blame it on those drinks, blame it on everybody except for your own race, blame it on white privileges, blame it on white kids, and just blame it on white citizens. Aim it the vice president. Bunch of class clowns, niggas kneeling on the field, that's a flag down. How dare you try to make demands for this money? You gon' show us some respect, you gon' stand for this country, nigga. Mm, I'm, not really. I'm just prepared for this type of war. I heard Eminem's rap at the awards. Who's he fighting for? Y'all can take that motherfucker too. He ain't white no more. <laughs> <laughs> you wanna be so famous? You'll do anything for attention no, and a little payment. I can't take you nowhere when our people put your thing. His pants hanging off your ass. You ain't got no home training. Put your fucking pants up, nigga. Put that suit back on. Take that do-rag off. Take that gun out your mouth. Quit the pitiful stuff. And then maybe police will stop killing you. Fuck you. What the fuck? I'm not racist. It's like we're living in the same building but split into two floors. I'm not racist. But there's two sides of every story. I wish that I knew yours. It wants to hear it. Okay. I like this. That was nice. Oh, uh, this is wow. cool. So, though. His perspective. I wish that I knew yours. I've seen from both sides of perspectives in one video, though. Not racist. I, I like it. I swear. With all disrespect, I don't really like you, white motherfuckers. That's just where I'm at. Mm. Screaming, all lives matter is a protest to my protest. What kind of shit is that? Mm. And that's one war you'll never win. The power in the word nigga is a different sin. We shouldn't say it, but we do, and that's just what it is. But that don't mean that you can say it just cause you got nigga friends. Nigga. <laughs> that word was originated for you to keep us under. And when we use it, we know that's just how we greet each other. And when you use it, we know there's a double meaning under. And even if I wasn't picking cotton physically, that don't mean I'm not affected by the history. My grandmama was a slave, that shit gets to me, and you ain't got no motherfucking sympathy, you pussy nigga. <laughs> I'm sorry, you can never feel my life. I'm trying to have faith, but I never feel alright. It's hard to elevate when this country's ran by whites, judging me by my skin color and my blackness. Trying to find a job, but ain't nobody call me back yet. Now I gotta sell drugs to put food in my cabinet. You crackers ain't slick, this is all a part of your tactics. Don't talk about no motherfucking tax. When I ain't making no dope, 
You think you know everything, but you don't. You wanna copy our slang and everything that we know. Sure Try do. to steal black culture and make it your own. Yep, Whoa. true. Fuck, I'm exhausted. I can't even drive without the cops trying to star shit. Tired of this systematic racism bullshit. All you do is fall shit. This the shit that I'm false with. And you don't know shit about my people. That's what bothers you. You don't know about no fried chicken or no barbecue. You don't know about the two step or no loose change. You don't know about no two chains or no Kool Aid. You don't know. Mm -hmm. Didn't even know Barack was half as black. You hated President Obama. I know that's a fact. You can't wait Trump to get him out and put a cracker back. Obama. And then he gave us Donald Trump, yeah, and I was paid back for that. Though. I'm not racist. Mm. I never lied, but I noticed a disconnect between your culture and mine. Yeah, I praised Tupac right. like he was a fucking god. He was fighting for his life way before he fucking died. Nigga, die, mm. nigga. And all you care about is money and power and being ugly. And that's the cracker within you. Hate it all in your brain and slowly start to convince you. Then you teach it to your children until the cycle continues. Blaming on Puerto Rico. Blaming on OJ. Blaming on everybody except for your own race. Blaming on black niggas and blaming on black citizens. Aiming the black businesses. I ain't saying I'm innocent, but. Yep. I might be yep. any day now. Treating everybody how you want in any way how. I swear North Korea about to bomb us any day now. And now I'm ducking every time I hear a fucking plane now. Two. For real. I know you know who I make a lot of sense because you can't about, admit it. When Eminem went against Trump, that was the illness. Cause even though he's white, he let us know he's standing with us. I'm not racist, but I cry a lot. You don't know what it's like to be in a frying pot. You don't know what it's like to mind your business and get stopped by the cops. And I know if you about to die or not, you worry about your life, so you take mine. I love you, but I fucking hate you at the same time. I wish we could trade shoes or we could change lives. So we can understand be each other more, but yeah. that'll take time. I'm not racist. Just a little bit of information. It's like we living in the same building, but splitting up both fine. sides. I'm not racist. But there's two sides of every story, and now you know mine. Yep. You can't erase the scars with a bandage. Hug it out. Hug it out, bro. To an understanding. Oh, that was good, Agree to disagree, we can have an understanding. I'm not racist. Ooh, I, I see why this is trending. I wish I could hug it out in real life, though. You about to cry? I was. Mm. Now they can have a okay. We so are. We're all humans until race disconnected us, religion separated us, politics divided us, and wealth classified us. Mm. That is. That was beautiful, man. That's Shout really out to good. Jordan Lucas. That is. Ooh, that was. It reminded me of some like Kendrick Lamar type. You know, that was. Oh wow, that was. I like how he was showing basically like the two sides of like the spectrum, basically. Mm, mm, mm. Like was... the people wearing the Make America Great Again hats how they see us and why they see us that way and how we see them and why we feel that way towards them mm -hmm. and it all it's all it all dates back to like history and everything like that like he said like oh you you guys uh complain about slavery as we were there but we are affected by it because mm -hmm. our ancestors which is not that long ago like grand grandparents and mm -hmm. great grandparents were slaves it was just a and it's like a trickling effect like he said yeah. like you teach that to your kids and so on and so on and the cycle mm -hmm. continues and everything so the hate just continues and continues and continues because because of that i just always wonder why why can it never be peaceful on planet earth mm -hmm. the only thing that could destroy man is man and it's happening and like he said the missile could come anything yeah that's what i'm now. saying why can't and we just have peace like like I just that's what boggled me from my mind mm -hmm. why can't we have peace I, I like I don't know like I don't know we can never just have peace on earth there's never been a period of time where it was just like we're trying to just elevate each other have fun be peaceful it's always you know like war and fights and this and, and even that now, it's just like in insane yeah the slave trade in Libya and you know people no, like getting, yeah you know, this has been happening for a while and nobody was speaking about it until now mm -hmm. and it needs to it needs to end so it's it's just it's, it's just a lot in this world and it's all because of people's misunderstanding of each other mm -hmm. and they like he said he said we don't blame our own race we blame it on everybody else mm -hmm. basically so it's it's a, it's a lot that we still have to go through it's a lot we still have to go it's, through it's a lot that we still have to go through like to come together and stuff cuz and to elevate each other. So it's, a, it's all, like, it's not just like black, white, 
Yeah. Spanish or, you know, Native American or Indian or Because even whatever, when you get that, like I've all, gotten it, I've gotten comments a lot since like forever saying that like people have told me that I talk like I'm white. Yeah. He said we're the whitest and, couple on yeah. YouTube. Why this black couple on I YouTube? never understood that because I'm like, okay, so do you see people, black people, as talking a certain way? At that, 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 that's what it tells me. It's like, okay, so you just see black people speaking one way, but I, I don't even see myself talking any type of way. It's just talking normal. Yeah. It's just how I speak. And then they'll say, oh, you talk like you're white. Like, what does that mean? So how am I supposed to talk? Like, I'm ghetto? Talking, like, I'm, what the, I like, don't know. like how am I supposed, how is a black person supposed to sound? Yeah. Please tell me. Cause I, I never understood that comment. Yeah, and no, I kind of blame I kind of blame uh, the, the stereotypes you see on TV, like Maury, and stuff like that. Because mm -hmm. the, the the way they portray it, and those are actors. It's, yeah, they're all acting. You know, I know it's entertainment, so. but it still has a. You know, what, I, I, I like getting and stuff like that. It is good to start a conversation. So guys, it I don't is. want you guys warning in the comments about who's right or who's wrong. I want us to come together as a community and try to uplift one each other and yeah. you know have fun and elevate yeah have fun and, and just enjoy our lives because not everybody's going to agree on everything That's yeah just the, i know yeah i know that we know that but learn to like you could still be like cordial with somebody even though yeah. you can't just like, like agree yeah. with like what they what their morals are or what their ideology would be or whatever yeah that, so. that was a great song shout out to Jordan lucas make sure you guys Check his stuff out. We'll leave yeah. it in the link in the description below. This needs a million. I don't know why it's, it's close. We're we gonna get it there, man. We need to get to a million views. Yeah. So, so yeah, share Everybody it. You know, do what you gotta, guys. Loyalist Kingdom. We do. We flex like oh. <laughs> uh, make sure. You, yeah. So guys, comment below. Tell us what you think, man. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share.